okay dear students let us see what is there in this question of a particle performs a simple harmonic motion what is the phase difference between the displacement and the acceleration okay so my dear students i don't think that there is any easy method for this um, method we have to go to the actual uh, thing and uh, okay uh, the formulas which are available in the data booklet, I'm going to use only those formulas. So the first formula that is given in the data booklet is this, that acceleration is given by this. And the displacement can be given by two different methods. Um, that will be x naught sine omega t or it can be given by x naught cos omega t also. So you can use any out of it, no problem at all. So let us go for sine 1. So if this is sine, or let us go for cos, even that is not a problem. So we can see here that acceleration is having a negative sign. So whichever graph this x is going to make, like let's say we are going to have a sinusoidal variation in the case of sine like this. If this is the variation for the displacement with respect to time, so how will the acceleration be there? Or I can show the acceleration in the same graph with a different color now. So you see, how will I be showing that? So I can say that acceleration will be having a different magnitude, but definitely it is negative x. So negative sine theta. So negative sine theta will be somewhat like this with a different with a different uh, magnitude, which will be more than this anyways, but I'm not drawing like that. Please don't go from that point of view. The only thing is that I'm just saying uh, how the graph will look like. So if this is the displacement shown in black, the pink color is showing you the acceleration. So what what do we find from this thing? We see that this acceleration is actually the copy of uh, the copy of I can say this displacement like it is moving from this side like this. So this is the graph that I have taken from the displacement graph which is which looks similar to the acceleration graph isn't it? Now it only means that you have just moved the blue color towards this. So it means that at t is equal to 0, the value of the acceleration is pi degrees ahead of the displacement. So you can say that the acceleration, acceleration is pi radians ahead of displacement. So whatever is the displacement, the acceleration is pi degrees away at the same point and hence the phase difference will be taken as pi there is no other method to understand it like that is the only method so i what i'm I, I will repeat myself this is the function of the displacement and this becomes the acceleration from here you can see that the acceleration will be 90 degree like 180 degree opposite it would be negative completely so when the displacement is maximum the acceleration is minimum it's like that okay and hence you can say that the phase difference between the two or the relative motion between the two will be of pi degrees. So this is how we do it. My dear students, let us verify the answer once, so whether it is coming out to be C or not. Yes, the answer is C. My dear students, if you have any doubt in this question, because there can be like the phase difference and all that, it's a bit confusing. So if, if you ever you have this kind of a doubt, please mention that in the comment section. I would be replying you there. All the best.